Hey, how are you guys doing? So this time, I'm going to talk about another set of outfits. So before, if you remember, I did the Toki Meki Runner outfits. I ranked each one based on how I felt. And eventually, I'll go over the results for that pretty soon here. But each girl had their own outfits paired with their own songs. And I wanted to expand this and do it for a bunch of other outfits and songs that is available in the Love Less Well Festival All-Stars game. So I do have a Google Sheet where I try to keep track of all the outfits, pair them together, as well as results going so far for outfits. And we've done the initial outfits for Muse, and now we're going to do the initial outfits for Aqua, and that one being the Ultra Rare outfits. I try to host all the results as well as any of the, the polls that are currently going on. And in, in, you know, at a minimum, this could be a nice page for you to look at all of the available outfits available in the game. So let's go ahead and go over my individual opinions, and then we can go ahead and discuss what you guys think and which place is deserved for each individual outfit for the Ultra set. So of course, the way I'm ranking it, it's mostly based on opinion, but it's going to be mostly focused on the outfit itself, not the art. The art doesn't mean really anything. It, art could be nice, but the focus here is ranking on the outfits themselves. It shouldn't really necessarily be super focused on the character itself, but being fitting for that girl does help it a little bit. But the main idea here and the main focus is how much you like that outfit. If you don't like the outfit, it's not going to get a good placing. So let's go ahead and start with my least favorite out of this set. So in last place, I do have Chica's outfit here and it's... I don't know. The, the, this outfit's kind of really dominated by the fact that it's a plaid blue dress here. The hat is nice and I do like the fact there's a lot of fruit involved into this. But that's more of the art itself and not the outfit itself. It's kind of a simple plain blue plaid dress and I do like the blue coloration and the orange. I think that's a nice accent. But man, this is just, I don't know, underwhelming to say it the best. I don't want to say it's bad, but it is last. So take that as you will, but unfortunately, I just I just feel like plaid doesn't work here. Then and there's nothing too special about this outfit that makes me think, wow, I would want this. So unfortunately, this one is going to be my least favorite out of this set. Following that up, we have Kanan, and uh, it's a good card. It's been Caramade All Stars, and I have this card. It's really nice, but outfit wise, it's kind of. Well, the best way I could put it is it reminds me of the Arizona green tea and that just put that on a dress. And I mean, Arizona tea is good and all, but for a dress? Are you, are you sure? Uh, I mean, the, the teal and the coloration are just, you know, the same here. And I was hoping something a little bit more interesting and fun than just the simple kind of traditional outfit that you would wear when you're going out to like fireworks and stuff. So I just feel like this one's kind of okay. I feel like I'm being a bit harsher, but honestly, I just feel like there's more interesting extravagant outfits out here. And for an idol, having a decent outfit is just, you know, underwhelming. Now we hit up Yo, and I love the theme of this one, and the art's really great. But of course, that's not what's necessarily important here. The outfit and the, uh, the theme of the outfit here is, again, something I thought was really cool, and I really do appreciate it. I just... I don't know, I feel like the execution of it felt a little more off to me. Maybe it's just because the coloration, I'm not the biggest fan of it. Maybe with a different color, I would actually like this a lot more. But overall, for the dress, it's... I see where the theme's coming from, but I just feel like it's a slight miss for me. I don't know. The shoulders feel a little off. And maybe it's just me thinking the color is a little odd. So maybe if I saw a different coloration, I would like this more. But I do really like the fact that it's the bunny theme here, because of course it's going to Alice in Wonderland, which I do really appreciate. I think it's still a pretty decent dress. I just like the other outfits more than this one. So for Ruby, we get this kind of circusy kind of feeling outfit here, and I gave the slight edge to this over Yo's mainly because I think this was a little more fitting for Ruby. I don't, I mean, it's not like I find Ruby to be like a clown or anything, but. It kind of has that fun, happiness kind of vibe, you know, that cute, goofiness kind of vibe that you might get from Ruby sometimes. And this dress is, oh, it is definitely a bit cute and definitely has that pink coloration that is so related to Ruby. But I don't know, the dress doesn't seem to really wow me in any particular place. I just think it's a nice dress overall. 
So that's what more or less why I put it here. Now we end up hitting Maris and I still use this outfit to this day because man this game does not give me good Mari outfits. But this one definitely is a pretty decent one. The card itself not exactly that strong. But I do actually like this outfit a good amount here. Now the we have that strong purple kind of thing which again is related to Mari. But I think this is a nice kind of sweet outfit. It's a lot of the flowers which I think goes well with Mari. And I don't know what that bonnet on her head or whatever you call it. I do think that it's also another nice addition to this outfit. It's not quite wow factor for me here, but it's definitely an outfit that I do like throwing on for her. And now we get to Hanamaru, which this one I was debating if I liked this more than Madi's because I wasn't entirely sure. But if you were to ask the game, apparently the game thinks this is my favorite card in existence because I pulled it four times. I like the card, but this card's not that good. But the outfit itself is honestly pretty cute. I like the... We got the ram horns or something like that on Hanamaru. And I think that's a nice cute pink hat. We got kind of that fluffy kind of thing on our shoulder. Which, I don't know, I kind of like that as well. And the outfit itself is pretty nice as well. I kind of like the contrast with the dark with the gloves and the leggings. I think it's pretty nice. And it, it kind of fits that kind of Hanamaru vibe a bit. Where she kind of likes being warm and fluffy or something. Maybe you disagree, but I do think this is quite a nice outfit. I do like it, but maybe that's because I've been forced to use it ever since the game came out. And then here we get what I noticed a very big increase on my desire of wanting this card if I didn't have it or how much I like these cards. And this one I do not have for Yoshiko and I do think this is definitely one of my favorite Yoshiko outfits out there. I really like the theme that it has and it's very fitting for Yoshiko, especially like that grading on the bottom part of her dress. I think that's really cool. I like that she has kind of a little hat and of course having that wings makes me really feel that kind of Yohane kind of theme that she always seems to be going with, especially with all her outfits. So I do think this is a really nice outfit for her. I don't know if this is my favorite out of hers. But this is definitely a really good one, and I do expect a lot of people to generally like this kind of style of the Yohane outfits. And in second place, I have Rico's outfit, and I debated if I wanted a second or third, but I ended up giving this edge to Rico. So uh, this is definitely a very nice outfit for Rico, although I feel like the art makes it look nicer than the actual outfit itself is, especially because if the transparent parts of the dress are not transparent, which it's definitely hinders it overall. I wish All Star outfits had some form of transparency in dresses, but perhaps they don't have it for some reason, which kind of sucks. But honestly, this is a good outfit, and I'm glad they did bring this because this is a very good outfit for her. I don't always use this because I don't know if it really is the true Rico kind of feel because I feel like some other outfits depict Rico better here. But of course this angel outfit is really nice and it's great how it contrasts Yohane's outfit here which you know they, they have their own deal with together and having that be so opposite is also fun in its own way. But the, having the wings here, the nice layering to the dresses are all nice although I wish there was more things covering her actual legs but the outfit is of course excellent and of course I have this one and it is very nice to have. And for my favorite from the set is without a doubt Dai's outfit here. There was no doubt in my mind I was going to make this number one when I was planning to go through this because I just love this outfit and I'm so glad I have this one because this one is just the kind of the perfect image for Daya. And well, even if it is just perfect, I think the outfit is also very good. And I'm not just saying because the art looks amazing here, but this outfit really does resemble the traditional feel of Daya. And also it looks good. That's basically simply put why I like it so much here. It definitely has a lot of elements into the dress here. But it doesn't go too over the top with anything to make it very untraditional like here. The I like the colorations, the black, the red, the white. They all look very nice and with all the kind of gold layering on the top near her chest. I think it's really nice and all that trim. I just think it's a really nice dress overall and hopefully you guys see that way too but that's just how I personally feel this has definitely been my favorite die outfit so far 
and I do think this is the standard that the other outfits will be measured for for Daya. But let me know in the comments below what you think is the best. Of course, there is a poll here where you guys can vote, rank through 1 through 9, 1 being your favorite outfit and 9 being your least favorite outfit of this set. I have, of course, all the images below if you need it as reference, or of course, this video as well to help you out when you vote in that poll. So make sure you visit the link in the description to vote in that poll, as well as the Google Sheet where I show where we'll show all the other outfits and of course keep up to date with that because of course I do plan on making more videos like this. So let me know what you guys think in the comments below. What is your favorite outfit and why? Is it just because it's your best girl already think that outfit is just so excellent? Of course I'm sure many of you don't agree with me per se here. So let me know why that outfit is your favorite. Hopefully you guys enjoy these kinds of videos because if you do I of course plan on making more. So again, make sure you visit the link in the description and vote in the poll. Thank you guys for watching, and I hope to catch you guys in another video soon.